Good morning. Here is today's word of blessings for you. Psalm 119 105. Your word is a lamp for my feet, a light on my path. Today's title is Ten Commandments. Overview 1. The Light of the World. Most people know what the Ten Commandments are, whether they are Christian or not. It is relatively short and concise. We can read it through in less than one minute. But not many people truly know how significant it is to us. Many non-Christians consider it as a summary of the religious doctrine of Judaism or Christianity that has nothing to do with them. Some Christians view it as an old and obsolete law that has no relevance to modern Christians. Based on such secular and modern views, people try to get rid of the historic monuments that display the Ten Commandments in public places such as courts and schools. Even now fierce legal battles are going on about whether such monuments of the Ten Commandments should be removed in several states. What do you think? I believe that the Ten Commandments are one of God's most essential revelations and truths for all mankind. As core teachings of the Bible, it had a great impact on Western civilization and human history. Historically, God has given it to the Israelites. But like all other revelations of God, I believe it is meant to show the truth of God to all mankind. God led Israelites with the pillar of cloud and fire in the wilderness. Likewise, I believe the Ten Commandments were the spiritual and intellectual light for the people of Israel who became mostly blind to the revelation of God after 400 years of slavery in Egypt. Later, it enlightened all mankind who became spiritually blind by sin. The Ten Commandments, though simple and concise, include the most fundamental and essential teachings of God for all ages. The light breaks the darkness of the world and brings us closer to God. There is absolutely no harm in holding genuine respect. We just need not use it illegalistically. For anyone who does that, it will be a lamb for your feet and light unto your path.